Schöne Papier. Schöne Papier. Hoppy, come on, let's go fly. Hoppy, where's Hoppy? <laughs> Do I have to come get you? Oh, oh you can. One, <laughs> two, three, <laughs> go! normal to be alive. I mean, it's, yeah, <laughs> you know what I mean. Anyway, I am back and we have a scary event. Roll this clip. Okay. 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 Come, don't run. Do, do not do do not run. Do not run. Okay. I just took my knee. Okay. Okay. What do we do? Uh do not run. Do not run. That's the worst. What should I do? likes to scream at the bird. Where, where, where? Where's the pigeon? Where's the pigeon? Where? Whoa! 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 Where? He likes to scream at birds. Especially pigeons. Where, Hoppy? Do you want to go chase it? You want to go chase the pigeon? You want to go chase the pigeon? Yeah? Okay, go chase. One, two, three, go! Okay guys, here's the story. This is what happened. So I went hiking like I always do, like three times a week. Moss, you like it? Moss, how are you doing? <laughs> no, not there. Yeah. Moss, you like it? <laughs> um, and I always go to the same trail because I love that trail because it's just so beautiful and there's not so many people. Hi guys, so we are... <clears throat> hey you beautiful CDPs, welcome to my channel! So we're today in this beautiful waterfall. Here's Hopi. Hopi. It's so beautiful to be alive in this time. Let's see what Opie's reaction. Hopi, how do you like the waterfall? How do you like the waterfall? I like to sit on my head. It's always best to be up on the top. It's the best spot. Hoppy, you like the waterfall? You like the waterfall? <laughs> um, so we went hiking and I noticed, wow, it's pretty like secluded today. Like not a lot of people around. So um, I just didn't mind it and thought, okay, a little more solitude, that's fine. And then I came around the corner on the trail, like 30 feet away, like basically 10 meters away, I saw a bear. Yeah. 
and I didn't know what to do. I froze. I had hope and love on my shoulder. I was go hiking with them. And then I just back up, got out my camera, start filming, and my birds started screaming. And And like a balloon, I, ha I, ha I have them here, like on the harness, like a balloon. They were like flying around me and I had the harness like around my wrist. And they start screaming and I look around and hi. <laughs> um, hi, that's a doggy. Yeah, it's a doggy. And I look around and then I saw, I looked by back and I saw the bear was still following us. Do not run, that's the worst. What should I do? My birds are screaming. And then I panic. And I just thought like, I'm gonna be eaten by a bear right now. This is my last day, I'm gonna die. I really thought that. I don't know what to do when I see a bear. I saw all these signs, but I've never seen a bear. Oh, 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 Hoppy. Uh oh. I think the dog is curious about hope. Hey, Hope. Hope is having fun. I'm also now more relaxed with Hope being on the ground because look at that. Look at how empty is this park. So empty, so beautiful. Nothing is here, so that's okay. Yeah, so I look around. Birds are freaking out and just like I had to react really fast just to save the lives of my birds. I felt like the the bear is gonna come and attack me and my birds are gonna be like eaten took them off my wrist and I was like like the bear should just get me and maul me and not my birds and I release my birds and then I fall and trip because I look around and the bear was really close following us and I trip and then when I trip I, 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 I fall on my knee right here and I sprain it and then I was on the ground and I was like, everything happened so fast and there was so much ad an adrenaline. Hey, Hoppy, do you want to come up? Do you want to come up? Hey, you want to come up? So there was so much adrenaline. Where's the bird? Go fly! Hi, Hoppy. Where? Where? What, Hoppy? What are you seeing? What are you seeing? What is there? Is there a birdie? Is there a birdie bird? Is there a birdie bird? Come here. Step up. Yay. Go fly. One, two, three, go! Go! Uh-huh. Uh-huh. So there was so much adrenaline going on that when once I got up, I just like, look, I was like, where's my birds? I thought they would be sitting on a tree. But when I look, they were just in the bushes, hanging up with each other, like with open wings. And I was like, oh shoot, I have to get them. So, um, so I got my birds, put them on my shoulder and I was limping. And I look behind and the bear is still following us. Do not run, that's the worst. What should I do? My birds are screaming. Oh my gosh and i was like okay i i don't know what to do <laughs> so i just like you know um just limp walk really slow limp i couldn't run i just limp my way back i don't know what would happen and all of a sudden this hiker show up do not run that's the worst what should i do my birds are screaming No, stop. Okay. Stop. 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 If I run, they will chase. Yeah, they chase you. Oh, shit. You need to make yourself bigger. That's what you need to do. Stay there, Blue. Stay there. Whistle? Yes. Huh? Uh, a 
have a whistle with me. Okay, good. Um, I just they, twist. They, they, they just. They laugh. Oh they, my they, god. They, yeah, they were always, freaking out. You always are. Oh, you guys are always flying. Yeah. All right. Oh, you're so beautiful. I know. I wouldn't have known. <laughs> I, I have a whistle, but I didn't take it today with me. Uh huh. I have all, I have an air horn with me too, but it's in my. I forgot to put it on my pockets. Oh really? It, it is in my backpack. That, that helps a lot. An air horn? Air horn. It costs like $11 on Amazon. Yeah, I have to get one. Yeah, I have to get one. Right. <laughs> we are so in shock. <laughs> Ay, that was a bear. A bear? Yeah, we just <gasps> saw a bear right there. Oh. She was running away. And I just, her. yeah. It was a big one. A big one? Yeah. Oh. He yeah, was it scary. Into, into our right hand side right now. It moved away. Yeah, he was chasing us. Oh. He was chasing you? Yeah, and I twist my my knee. I fell. Oh, that was scary. He, the bear came from the waterfall or from one of the walls? I think, I don't know, he just showed up. I was like, shit, and my birds start like screaming. And once they start screaming, I freaked out too. <laughs> oh, I'm still shaking. Oh my God. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Your mama feels more okay. relaxed. Do you okay. feel relaxed? Okay. Wow. If I would have run, they would have attacked me, right? Yeah. Never, never run. If you see a bear, a mountain lion, a bobcat, never, never run. What you need to do is just make yourself bigger. Bigger. bigger and make a lot of noise. A lot of noise. A lot of noise. Yeah, you need to start yelling and make, your, yeah, make yourself bigger. What about throwing stones? No. No? No. Because that's a way of like attacking the bear. The bear attacking the bear. I didn't know and, what to do. I was some, so scared. And sometimes uh, their cubs are around, so that's the worst too. Because oh, probably, the babies! Probably they are protecting and looking for their cubs. So that's why you gotta just make yourself bigger and just move away. Sometimes just standing, st staying just quiet, and standing in one place. Yeah. They they just ignore you. Yeah. I'm so happy you were here. I wouldn't have known what to do. I had a whistle. I know you have to whistle when you see a bear, but I didn't take it with me today. Yeah, I, I have a whistle with me, so I started using the whistle. I don't know if you heard the noise when... Yeah, because the bear came... The bear, the bear came over here to this... Uh, like a, those three rocks over there, and it stops right there so it's when i started using the whistle and then the bear uh, moved uh, started walking back yeah. and just cross the river bed yeah yeah he took off once he started whistling wow i was about to release my birds and and then luckily they both of them they started flying because uh -huh. they fully flied it right and then they end up in the bushes and I got them back real fast. Okay. If they would uh, fly around, they could be caught with the harness in the tree and then it will be even harder to get them back. To get them back, yeah, because they're gonna get tangled. Yeah. yeah. But in emergency, I didn't, wow. Well, well. Yeah, just, I mean, the, the, the berries just move away. It's just now here on the trail. Yeah. And people just need to be aware, pay attention, you know what I mean? Because yeah. some, honestly, I'm gonna say that probably 99% of the time people are busy on their cell phone listening to music uh -huh. and not paying attention uh -huh. to, you know, to the surrounding. Uh huh, exactly. Yeah, so um, I, uh, what it got our attention is when my dog went into a little mode right over there, he stopped. He was just like a, with his paw. He left one of his paws like this. Because and he heard my bird screaming? Uh, no, before. Before even? Before, before. He right away went into alert mode. I'm like, okay, what's going on? First thought, uh, a snake, you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, so, and then I heard the birds. So it's when he started dragging me, right? And then I saw you with the birds and I saw the bird behind you and it was running. You know, and my dog antagonized with bears. Wow. So I gotta hold him tight <laughs> oh, <wow. laughs> because I don't want him, you know, attacking or trying to attack the bear. Yeah. 
right? So and we move over here. We were, I was expecting probably that the bear wants to continue on the trail. Yeah. I guess it's looking for water, you know, just to cool off and, and drink a little bit. Um, but he was huge. You looking. It was a big looking, bear. It was big. Big bear. Like a two? No, probably Half like size. a this high, this high, I guess, oh. from, yeah. Yeah, it went yeah. up to like right here. Yeah, well, based on her height, yes. Wow. Yeah. But if he would stand up, he would be like as big as I am. Yeah. And I'm like, what, 5'9"? It's kind of traumatizing, isn't it? When you're, you can see oh my gosh, yeah. so scary. Yeah. And I run and then I twist my knee. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and then I fell and my birds are all crazy freaking out. And then I freak out and I was like, shit, what should I do? And I thought my first instinct was throw stones. And he was chasing me. Yeah, because you he were running. Yeah, at the moment you start running, yeah. you become the prey. Yeah. Yeah, you, you don't you don't run. Next time, just remain calm and watch, you know, in which way you want to go and also the bear, but do not run. Uh -huh. yeah. Make yourself bigger. Probably, they're probably uh, not interested in fighting with you if they feel that you're confident. You know? Yeah. I mean, if they feel that you're not running away, that mm -hmm. they, they don't feel like they're feeling like you did anyway. Like not, you know. I feel like he's going to attack me because of my birds. I thought like my birds might be prey. Probably. But you running in the birds? I, I'm, I'm guessing double prey. Double prey. Like, oh, look, jam me food over here. Yeah. <laughs> right wow, there. I'm so glad you Peek came. Peekaboo. Wow. Ah, you're so beautiful. Oh, I'm gonna head back now. I'm all kisses? shaking. Can you give me kisses? I'm shaking. I love that color. I was just noticing in a magazine that uh, someone was wearing a shirt and headband in that indigo color. I was just uh, thinking, that has just got to be the most gorgeous color. Yeah. Oh, the, the, the blue? blue the, yeah, the, the, the yeah. Blue He's yeah. a blue macaw. Really rare. Oh, really? Almost extinct. Wow. From Brazil. Bolivia and oh, really? Colombia and so we got those in the, oh, in the Amazon yeah yeah in the Colombian Amazon yeah. it's okay yeah. Hopi it's okay wow yeah. cool yeah Colombia from Nicaragua and you're really close to the waterfall yeah really, really close. close I'm yeah, yeah. Don't don't go back. Just go to the waterfall. It's just probably five minutes more. Uh, yeah. well, we're actually here to solve a problem. We're not really here for a walk. We're just here oh, okay. to solve a problem. Oh, okay. okay no problem. <laughs> <laughs> well, you solve my problem. I would have been. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Have a good one. You okay. solve my problem. Are you with me? Yeah, I think I would have been barefoot today. Wow, Where I wouldn't have been expecting it. Look, look at the bird. Yeah. Is he okay? Yeah, he's okay. Okay, good. He's, he's fine, he's calm. This is one of the most scariest experiences ever. I've lived here since over 15 years and I've never seen a bear. Wow. wow. This is now our first time. Um, Love, you want to come back? It's our first time, like in one year, probably. One year? In one year, our first time. But we've seen uh, bears before. Bears, bears and cubs and mountain lions and bobcats. A lot of rattlesnakes. Yeah, bob snacks and snakes, bobcats and snakes. I'm not afraid of. They mm -hmm. they move away. Yeah. I saw also snakes, but this bear was huge, yeah. and just looking at me. Oh, on there, you see what is there? A big on the stone. On oh, the stone? No, that's a tiny stone. Oh, that's a tiny stone. It's yeah. not an animal. No. It looks like a gecko or something. Uh -huh. it's, it looks like. <laughs> One day I went over there to double check because <laughs> we were sitting here relaxing. <laughs> Looking into that direction, I'm like, what the kind of animal is that one over there that is not moving? <laughs> yeah, it's not moving. It's gonna turn into a dinosaur. Or <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! And, uh, we, we went over there and we touch. Yeah. And, uh, it is a rock. <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> That's good. He has all these bells too. Yeah. Uh, um, I follow you on Instagram. Yeah. Right. Um. I, do, I just don't remember the handle on Instagram. Angelic underscore Okay, parents. Angelic, Angelic. I'm going by Angelic. So I, I shared this video on Instagram. Uh, his account is Blue okay. the Terrier Mix. Blue or left and right? 
I was hiking solo in nearby Mount Wilson when I saw a mama bear with two cubs. That day I got scared, you know, I, I froze, you know, but then I'm like, you know what? I'm just here, that over there, by the water, I'm fine, right? And they, they walk away. They walk away, you walk away too? Or you yeah, just I walk away stood too. your ground and just waited? No, uh, I walk away too. Slowly. I just, slowly and I start watching, they went into the opposite direction and me too so I'm like okay that's that's fine wow. and then i started writing reading articles. more articles about bears and what was the best thing to do you know right. i read articles too but like in a situation like this you forgot everything <laughs> and you just panic yeah I know, I know <clears throat> because real life is different if you just read an article you are you are not a bird okay Aww. i know i know do you want to keep going okay we're going over there. Okay, okay? we're going Good back. Good to see you. So, and just relax, okay? Yeah. Just just pay attention right now, you know. Be aware about noises. Because yeah. sometimes, you know, rocks are falling. Yeah. It could be just the wind. Some Squirrels, branches birds. pulling. Birds, but also mountain lions. Just walking over here yeah. with scrolls, right? So, but always be, be alert. Especially now that you have, you know, we have animals. We have yeah. pets. You know, so we need to be more aware. Yeah, you know? because they are prey too. They are yeah. food. I was even thinking climbing a tree, but I was like, bears can climb. No, do not climb trees. You know, bears can I even, climb tree. I, I even, right now, we made the mistake to go over there because mm -hmm. bears try to use logs to just oh. cross too. Do not climb trees because bears climbs trees. Too. Better than you. Yes, much better. Right, so the best thing, the best thing is just you know, like I said, make bigger yourself, step away, yeah. make a lot of noise, yeah. air horns, whistles, you know, yeah, and protect the pets. Right. Thank you so much, Vlad. You, I'm shaking up. I'm gonna go home. <laughs> no, <laughs> ice my knee. Inhale, exhale. <laughs> you know, <laughs> and they're watching you like a mom. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> Thank you. Day. Bye, Vlad. Bye. Bye. Oh my gosh, guys. Oh my god. Wow, oh, I'm still shaking, guys. I'm still shaking. My knee hurts. I saw a bear and I freaked out. And the birds freaked out, starting flying away. And then I got them back. Oh my gosh. And my knee hurts right now like hell. But I have to, like, I'm limping, but I have to go back to the car. I think I'm just like half a mile away from the car. This gentleman was amazing. Flat knew exactly what to do and he had a whistle on him. Wow, what a scary experience. I've lived here for 15 years and never saw a bear. Ever, ever, ever. I saw a bear once in Yellowstone National Park, but not in Pasadena, California. And I know there's bears around, but this trail is so like hiked on and there's so many people. And I come here like three times a week. And today there was nobody in the waterfall. So that bear basically went to the waterfall to drink some water and then we bump into him. Okay, this is the first time I have seen this trail so empty. I've never seen this trail so empty before, but I am so happy I saw at least one human being. Because usually this trail is full of kids and people and hikers and even like like babies, like people bringing their babies and this is a very popular trail. And today, like, there was a bear. <laughs> and I'll just... <laughs> Oh, he just snapped a branch off the tree. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy we are okay. Nothing happened to us. God totally protected us. And the weird part of everything was I had a dream this morning, like today, this night, that I got attacked. I had a dream and then I woke up and I was like, let's go for a hike and boom, there was a bear attack. Wow, there was a bear attack. Wow. I could have lose my life or be eaten up, be like disfigured. My face could have been 
like eaten up and bitten. Birds could have been stuck in trees. Wow, what a scary experience. Scary experience. I'm walking now back to the car. I'm still limping and I'm just pressing myself. I am so frightened right now. I'm still shaking, still shaking. I need to go home and ice my knee. Wow. I'm gonna give you also later some advice of what you have to do when you see a bear. Don't act like I act. Wow. Ah, uh, no, I'm good. I'm fine. I'll just need to get to the car and then I will. I will. Hey, guys, stop fighting. Hey, stop fighting. Did you um, say you're from Uruguay? What? Where are you from? Oh, I'm from Germany. Oh, from Germany. I, yeah, because I wasn't hearing any accent from, you know, Uruguay or something. Oh, yeah, I'm German. <laughs> oh, I see. Yeah. Oh, interesting. Gosh, gosh, gosh. Anyway. Well, you yeah, he was just day. talking about how he saw a, a large bear over there and had a standoff with him, too. There's really? a lot of them here. Yeah, I didn't think they were this far down. I, I hiked down this, this uh, canyon down to the other side, and mm -hmm. that's where I saw it. Today? No, no, like about a month ago. Oh, wow. And then I saw a bobcat, too. But they're small. They're not. I mean, if you have pets, they will probably go after yeah, them. But yeah, yeah. Not you. A small pet. Yeah, yeah, bobcat, I'm not afraid. They are actually more afraid of us, the bobcats. Actually, yeah. you know, like, it, he was very shy, yeah. but he was, like, right by the, where this tree is at, and he wouldn't go anywhere. Mm -hmm. But I wasn't afraid of him or anything. But yeah. the bear was something else. Oh, <laughs> yeah, my gosh. Is it, would it be okay to take a picture of you and your bird? Of course, go for it. <laughs> All right, guys, have a good day. Oh, sure. oh th thank you. Yeah, be careful. <laughs> I was hoping he would put his head or she would put her head. Oh, I'll, I'll go this way. Oh, my gosh. Sure. So from over here is perfect. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. It's what? just so amazing. Thank you. Anything so if else you, you want to say? Yeah, so if you want to go on YouTube and check it out, because this video will be on YouTube. And uh, check this out. There's still like, there's a hole now in my pants from the fall and I'm still all dirty right here. Oh, yeah. Because it was a bear that was about four feet uh, on all four feet. Yeah, he was huge. He was like, he went up to my waist on all fours. Yeah. But if he would have like, you know, stretch and stand up, he would be as big as you and I am, you know? Yeah, yeah. It was scary. Yeah really scary but yeah, anyway I, I, <laughs> I'm so happy that this gentleman came oh I know the timing was so perfect oh that was we were talking to him for about five five or more minutes bef at the beginning right here oh, when really? we started so somehow that it all lined up that he was there did he help you with the when you were running or yeah something? he's like don't run stop don't run I was oh, like good. a bear a bear and I was limping and then he's like, don't run, don't run. Just make yourself bigger. Yeah. I mean, my birds were screaming ah. and I screamed too, I but he, too. he, he didn't care. He came right towards us. And then he I kept, start running. Coming to you? Yeah, yeah, he was so threatening. Wow. So maybe he was just curious, but you don't know what their intention is. You can't read their mind. You know? Probably because of birds. They are loud and colorful. Yeah. He probably never saw in his life <laughs> parrots before. <laughs> We'll be safe. Thank you. Bye. Okay, bye. Oh, back in civilization. Here is the caretaker house. Oh my gosh. And here, look. Look, guys. Bear County. Bear Country. Avoid confrontation. Don't surprise bears. Make noise. Hike during daylight hours only. In groups when possible. Orders attract bears. Leash your pets. Yeah, my pets are leashed. Oh my gosh, I'm still leaving here. Such a scary experience. They love it, but today was scary because we got attacked by a bear. Well, we saw the bear too. You did? Yeah. Oh my gosh, at the waterfall, we were all by ourselves. And then the bear just came charging. Miller, right here? No, at the waterfall. The almost. waterfall. At John, at John Mine. Miller, Miller Waterfall, right Miller? there. Millard? Oh, he's, move, he's moving. Yeah, he, he was all the way at Don Mine. Oh, wow. With the cubs? Oh, he had cubs? We I think, think another. I think so. Another group said they thought they saw cubs. They were had a dog. 
so I, charged you? Yeah, and I was running and I didn't know how to react. And I have it all on video. <laughs> he charged us. <laughs> and wow. I was about to release my birds. He's at, he's, that means he's coming this way. Well, and then a gentleman came and he blew his whistle and he went up the mountains. Um, okay. Yeah. okay. Yeah, I was just looking for my whistle. Like the one day I didn't bring it. Because I know. My whistle is in the car too. I always have a whistle for them too. And oh my gosh, I thought I would be bear prey. Yeah. It was scary. Yeah. Oh, where? Can wait, wait, wait. I? You have okay. to go back. Turn around. Is it well, picture? first of all, that's a picture, and then she has a video. Is He's coming the down the hill. You'll kind of see him pop out. But it was like a steep hill, and he was like. Oh, I see him right there. Yeah, yeah he's like yeah, charging. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I want to come charging. down this. Yeah. I also wanted to say that God totally protected me. Um, I'm just giving God all the credit to, like, you know, um, have Vladimir um, came right in time. Because when I was hiking this trail that day, I hardly see anybody, ah. just two girls. Just two girls on the whole trail. And then. What are the chances that right in time when the bear was following me that a hiker didn't show up and he had a whistle and he knew what to do. So go check out uh Mears and Blue's profile on on Instagram. <laughs> go like his profile because he's awesome. He he's basically a lifesaver. So Vladimir, if you watch this, thank you for being there. Thank you for being so cool. Thank you like for saving us. If you enjoyed this video, I am still alive. As you can see, my birds are good too. Nothing happened to us. But this was basically a really, really scary moment for us all. I've never seen a bear before, ever. Like, I live here since over 15 years. And I've been hiking this trail for over 10 years. Uh, like, you know, like between one to three times a week. I've never seen a bear. First thing, like, like the worst thing I've ever seen was like, like a snake or something, but never a bear. But anyway, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up, like, subscribe, go check out Angelic Parrots. I'm back now. I'm going to try to post um, two to three times a week again, just because I miss you guys. And I will see you next time. Says hi. Says bye. Says bye.